Z predicts. Z predicts. It's the greatest show on the internet. Now let's welcome our host, Z. Good day, good day, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Z, and welcome back to my world. Today or yesterday, we are here with NFL predictions for Week Five. Really quick, last week I went eight and seven for my overall record. Last week. That improves my overall season record to 36 and 29. That's still pretty good. Last week wasn't the best week. But before I get into my predictions and recaps, let's go straight to the fantasy. So we're here at my fantasy team, and what do you fucking know? I lost again, ladies and gentlemen. Golly. 84 to 111. I always face the good guys, you know? Jesus, that draws me to 1 and 3 on the season. Holy shit. Alright, let's go look at how my team did. Andrew Luck fucking sucked. 17 points. Marco Murray did was actually the best player on the team today. 23 points. Lamar Miller, 10 points. Larry Fitzgerald, screw you. Willie Sneak, go kill yourself. Julius Thomas, go rotten hell. Jerome Pryor, you're good. Dan Bailey, that's eh, a kicker. The Minnesota Vikings defense did great, too. And yet, we still fucking lost. Great. Let's just, let, let's get to the predictions, Jesus. So, before we get into the predictions, I want to talk about only one game from last week. And that is the Patriots and the Bills. Holy fucking shit. The Bills beat the Patriots. The Bills beat the Patriots. Oh my god. Okay, I listen to that game on the radio. Um, every week I go up here and I play Xbox or Madden or something, and I have a little speaker, I have this app on my phone, and I, I listen to any NFL game I want. So I was listening to the Bills game, and oh my god, it made me so happy. The Bills shut out the Patriots. I actually have full faith in the Bills this season. Oh my god, I think the Bills could actually sneak into the playoffs. Maybe. They have a pretty tough schedule. They need a lot of luck to make the playoffs this year, boys. But... The Bills beat the Patriots last week. 16 0. Fuck you, Sean, and Ben. Go kill yourself. Alright, so let's get into our predictions for this week. The first game on Thursday night will be the Arizona Cardinals and the San Francisco 49ers. Now, the Cardinals have been playing like absolute shit this year, and so are the 49ers. So, this is my, uh, well, I'm going to have to pick Arizona this one. Only because, well, it's San Francisco. I, I, I just, I can't pick San Francisco. I mean, I can't pick, I can't pick San Francisco right now over Arizona. I think Arizona's a better team. But, Arizona over San Francisco. Next game we have is the Miami Dolphins at the Tennessee Titans. I'm picking Miami this one. I just think they have a better team than Tennessee. You know what I mean? Um, I, both of them aren't really good teams. I'm just picking Miami this one. I, I, I can probably just trust them better than Tennessee. The next game we have is the Pittsburgh Steelers and the New York Jets. Ryan Fitzpatrick, kill yourself. I'm picking Pittsburgh in this one. Holy shit. Pittsburgh against Kansas City last week. That was, oh my god. Kansas City actually has a really good defense too. But Pittsburgh has a pretty good offense and they got Le'Veon Bell back. Wow, Le'Veon Bell is an absolute monster. But I'm picking Pittsburgh in this one only because it's New York Jets and Ryan Fitzpatrick. The Bears, the Bears and the Colts. I'm picking Indianapolis in this one only because it's it's the fucking Bears. Uh, Jay Cutler, go kill yourself. John Fox, I hope you get fired. Colts, every day, all day against the Bears. Minnesota Vikings against the Houston Texans. I'm picking Minnesota. Why? Holy shit, that defense. Oh my god. Wow. That defense is playing awesome. I think I, I'm predicting Minnesota Vikings will win the NFC North this year. If they don't, I will punch myself in the face. I'm dead serious. I will punch myself in the face if the Minnesota Vikings don't win the NFC North. Philadelphia Eagles at Detroit Lions. Carson Wentz. He looks like he could be the next big thing, okay? He's been, he hasn't thrown an interception this season. He's been absolutely destroying the other teams. Philadelphia over Detroit. Washington Redskins at the Baltimore Ravens. Picking Baltimore on this one. They have a better team than Washington. I think Washington's just garbage this season. They did beat New York a few weeks ago, but it is New York, so I'm picking Baltimore in this one. The New England Patriots against the Cleveland Browns. Guys, we've been waiting four weeks for this. Guess who's coming back? 
That's right, Tom fucking Brady, just like you saw right there. Tom Brady's coming back this week, and he will destroy the Browns as much as I hate saying it. The Patriots will win this week, only because, well, it's the Browns. Next game is the Atlanta Falcons against the Denver Broncos. This is my game of the week. Atlanta's been killing it this season. Matt Ryan threw for 500 yards last week against the Carolina Putty Cats. And then there's the Denver Donkeys, who actually, like, flat out just destroyed Famous Jameis. But you know I love Famous Jameis. We're not talking about Famous Jameis right now, but... I'm picking Denver in this one only because I think their defense will shut down Julio Jones, who caught 300 yards last week, but will not catch 300 yards this week. Denver Donkeys over the Atlanta Falcons. The San Diego Chargers at the Oakland Raiders. Oh, I'm picking Oakland in this one. It's going to be a close game. I just have more faith in Oakland this week. I think their defense is finally starting to come around a little bit. Oakland Raiders over the San Diego Chargers. The Cincinnati Bengals at the Dallas Cowboys. I'm picking Dallas in this one. I really do like Dak Attack better than Tony Romo. I just don't trust Cincinnati just yet this season. I'm picking Dak Attack over Andy Dalton in his flaming head. The Buffalo Bills. My Buffalo Bills at the St. Louis Rams. Holy God. The Buffalo Bills are killing it the last two games. I'm at, I have to pick Buffalo this week. I'm sorry. I'm picking Buffalo. I just don't. I know the Rams are 3-1. and one. I just don't. I can't see Buffalo not beating St. Louis. Oh, that's just St. Louis. I mean, L.A. Fuck you, Roger Goodell. The New York Giants at the Green Bay Packers. Aaron Rodgers against Elijah Manning. Aaron Rodgers over Eli Manning. Enough said. Finally, we have Famous Jameis at the Carolina Putty Cats. The Carolina Putty Cats. You know I love Famous Jameis, but that's right. I'm picking Famous Jameis over the Carolina Putty Cats. Carolina's been playing like a bunch of Putty Cats this past week. The past, they, they just suck this season, okay? I think uh, Tampa Bay will turn, this will be their turnaround game. We'll actually start winning some games. I'm picking Famous Jameis over the Panthers. I, Cam Newton's out with a concussion problem, most likely. I just don't see... Carolina winning against this game. It's a rivalry game, and all those division games are usually really close. But, famous Jameis over the Carolina Putty Cats. That is it for this video. Ladies and gentlemen, week five is in the books. I will see you guys next week. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to this channel. Have a great day, guys. This is Z, signing off.